Cafe Nero place. We've just finished, it's August the 14th, is yeah, that right, Matt? 14th. It's the 14th, yeah. we've just done, today we've done Poole, um, Bournemouth and Winchester. We're now in Winchester and we're just leaving. Um, um, I'll wedge it open. My Matt is going to wheel. What's that traffic? <laughs> The hard part about this tour is negotiating the parking. In fact, I will have to push. Yeah, and again. Yep. Okay. We're off. To see the wizard. Yes, we can see you, poopy pants. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> to get road rage now and then. Uh, so, uh, you know, I'll try not to swear. Music has always been very important within the store and we've spent a lot of time trying to get the right music, making sure that it enhances the atmosphere. I mean atmosphere in Cafe Nero is really important for us and rather than trying to just work with big names and sort of outsourcing the whole music proposition to a company who will just treat it like another contract, we've done a lot of it ourselves and we've tried to make a point of, of working with, with, with some big artists but also with a lot of up-and-coming artists and, and trying to help their careers and trying to play music that people won't have heard before. Brian Adams took my album cover photo. Um, basically, I was writing with uh, a guy called Phil Thornalley, and we'd written a couple of tracks on my album, and uh, Phil was writing with Brian as well. And he passed on an album to Brian, and Brian called me up, said he really loved the album, and he particularly loved Waterfall, um, and that's how I met him. And um, I knew that Brian was into photography, so I asked him if he'd take the album cover. A guy called Youth produced the album, which was another brilliant miracle because Youth was, I'm a massive fan of the stuff he's produced. He's produced Crowded House, Primal Scream, U2, The Verve, Dido. Basically had him in my head as someone that I wanted to produce the album and I thought I can just ask him, he can say no if he wants to. And I said to him, you know, will you produce my album? And he said, yeah, I'd love to. Um, I thought you were never going to ask. I thought I was going to ask someone else, so thank God I asked him. She's not only a great songwriter, she's a great singer, and she has a great personality. Very often I meet and hear people who have one of those three, Occasionally I meet people of two of those three, very rare to find someone who has all three. Baby, yeah. 